Brian's breaking stuff. Look at that. Clothes done. But look at this magic. This is like multiple use. Bing bing. Bing bing. Done done. Let's go. On to the next. Put it down, guys. <laughs> <laughs> guys, thank you guys so much for joining this channel right here. We got a good video coming up right here on Wyckoff's Adventures. Enjoy this video. All right, we got someone moving. They can't afford the $275 a month. That's an $80,000 rig and about a $2,000 setup that they are taking down. And can't afford $275 a month because they've been here eight years and Eddie had the price at $140 a month. And that this camp would be falling like it is if we didn't step in and raise the price. Because now we can do upgrades here on Lay Lake. Sorry to see them go, but very glad to see two more locations added right on top of the hill. Look at that view, right of Lay Lake. So, farewell. Finally got it going out of here. Very, very nice rig, but could not pay $275 a month. Been here eight years at least, man. The economy has gone up, but look at that spot, guys. Right over that hill, there is a, there is Lay Lake. So that is going to be a prime location. So everything happens for a reason. Farewell. Out with the old and more room. For the new to come out here and enjoy Lay Lake. And here we go, guys. We're going to walk up here. This is the site that was just being moved. And what a beautiful site this is. Right here. Coming up. So right here, beautiful sight. Right here of Lay Lake. Definitely a good spot here. Coming up. There's another one bites the dust, but you know what happens about that. One leaves, two more come in. So that's what it's all about. We leave one open, we can bring you guys in. So much love. Hopefully the old leaves, the new come in. So cannot wait for you guys to swing on by and love Lay Lake. Look at this. And this is how they leave it when they leave. But you know what? We don't need people like that here. So yeah, guys, we don't need people like that here at the camp that are disrespectful and cannot understand that when the economy and the prices of everything goes up, it is hard to fix a camp and to bring in new ideas to a camp without raising the rent because you have to have income coming in to have this business succeed and for its top 
potential because this camp has so much potential and that is why we are here. Me and Nick are here to save this camp with her mother. Her mother has done so much for this camp, holding on so tight. And we are here to help her prosper and to make this camp very, very lovable and a place where everyone can enjoy the next scenery coming in. So basically what it is, is what we have to do is we get, a, we get people out that does not understand that things are happening. Things are changing. Change is good. So that being said, two or say four people have to leave. So we can bring five or six or eight to ten more folks in here because the folks that left have been here eight years or more. Some only two years, but they've been paying $140, $170 a month. You can't get that anywhere in the United States right now. And if you can, uh, you better you better go run and get it. But I guarantee you that price will go up because if someone is charging that price at a camp, they're not making anything in the camp and the and the places that are that at the camp are most likely falling apart. You know, and we don't want this place falling apart. So we're gonna do everything we possibly can to save this park. This park used to be called Little Tom's Fish Camp, and now it's going to be Loveland Lakeside camp and market here on little tom's road so like you can see on the back it's coming coming shortly and also the food truck should be opening soon there's a big big uh boat tournament this weekend i really wish that we had this store open but it takes money to open that and we just don't have the funds um in the description there's going to be a give send go if you guys would like to help support and, and support this family business here um, and and help us please and thank you if you can't we understand it is hard times and it's okay but there is someone out there that would love for this camp to prosper just like we do and would like to see this camp prosper and maybe one day you guys will come out here and see the finish product and to enjoy what's out here but as of right now i showed you guys just now uh showed you two of the places two people that left there's going to be a couple more that are leaving that's okay that's more spots for you guys to come on down so right now i just took down the uh antlers that was on the store and we're going to go take them over here and i'm going to show you where i put them well, I'm working on it, still working on it, but I've already put two out of three up already. Right here, lovely hanging right here in the trees. Right next to the food truck. But I mean, it looks like the darn tree, right? It looks like the, the, um, the branches, right? But these will all fill out and it'll be all green. I'm gonna paint these pitch white so you guys will see them. And then the third one I'm putting up right here, right now. These are bucks that were were shot in these woods around Alabama. So those are trophies. So we're gonna put those up. They were just collecting spider webs on that window and really making a cluster on the storefront. So we're gonna spread them out and we're gonna put this one here on that tree right there so anyways i wanted to share that with you guys and again thank you so much for watching white cost adventures right here at love land lakeside camp and market on little tom's road here in clanton alabama much love guys